Well, that's a difficult situation. If the double chin usually is a result of two mechanisms, excess fat and skin sagginess. So if the skin, someone is still quite young, has a good skin tone, and it's just a matter of weight, well, by losing weight, we will improve definitely. If uh, that's not the case, by doing a liposuction and removing the fat and using, and I, I prefer to use a laser liposuction for that, uh, because then with the laser, we can tighten the skin and the skin will retract and have a good contour and good definition of the jawline also. But just removing the fat per se, sometimes it it's not enough because if there's a really double chin, what happens is you need to also address that skin. And so far, non-surgical treatments for excess skin or skin laxity are not very, very efficient. So one of the things I'm using now is a combination of several things. Uh, neurotoxin, Botox, to relax the muscle. We have a very strong muscle right under the skin that creates this, what you call the turkey bands. And, and by relaxing that muscle, we allow it to, to go back and get a better definition. Uh, removing the fat if there's fat and treating the skin in three ways. If the skin is good, just by doing a liposuction with laser, probably you got the result and you get, and it's done, it's finished. If the result, the skin doesn't tight as we want, we can add some threads to be able to balance it. And if the skin is in too much of excess and you cannot do that, then you have to go for surgery. The other thing is there's a lot of people that saying they have a double chin because now as I'm speaking with you, we tend to look down. And so what happens is you have extra volume under your chin. But sometimes it's not just a problem of fat, it's just a problem of the skin that you feel that's a bit uh, lax. So that's why you can use other things like uh, uh, IFU, which is uh, uh, focus ultrasounds uh, that can be helpful there. Radio frequency can be helpful there. Also, just threads can be help, helpful there. But sometimes you need to combine different strategies and different approach. So it's, a, it's not a, a size fits all for that. It's a, some, some of the areas that we need to be very, very, uh, uh, have to individualize the treatment and combine whatever we need to combine. But mostly when I got my patients coming for a double chain, I, I, I just can make a list of all the options, which is the best, most suitable for you, and you take it from there.